Hi everyone, welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within. After that resounding success, we're set. We are set. Excuse me. Council report in 18 days. We have no current missions, but here we go. The cybernetic interfaces are holding stable, but they're of no use without a cybersuit to interface with. I suggest we manufacture one immediately. When our new mech trooper equips that suit, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised with its capabilities. Project complete. Augmentation of Colonel Daniel Hall. You can now assign new mech troop, trooper class training and equip the soldier with a mech suit. Keys to mech deployment. Mechs are powerful armored suits with extra tactical abilities. Only mech trooper soldiers augmented in cybernetic lab may equip mechs in battle. The mech has three levels, three tech levels. Research is required to gain access to mech upgrades. Expensive. Flamethrower? No. Kinetic Strike module? This thing is awesome. Okay. Our cyber suits have faced the trials of battle and were proven effective. As we continue to deploy our mech troopers, they will grow more accustomed to the suits. And if fortune is with us, help with an end to this conflict. No, we're in, uh, build upgrades, so that's how you do it, okay. It's found under the engineering. Uh, you soldiers. Collateral damage. He just instant corporal, or colonel level, let's see by the looks of it. Advanced fire control, shoots from overwatch, no longer suffering any aim penalty, or no aim penalty. Confers two bonus damage against targets that have been opposed. Okay, damn it. When the mech takes damage, all further damage will be reduced by two for the next two turns. I like that. Jet boot mod module when active confers the ability to jump to normal normally inaccessible heights for the rest of the turn or one for all when active the mech becomes a high cover element moving or using an armed base weapon will return standard posture well, let's go with the jumps Repair surface converts two health recovery at the start of each turn. A total of six health can be regenerated per battle. Or expanded storage allows additional use of re a restorative mist, grenade launcher, proximity mine launcher in each mission. Increased primary weapon base ammo, but eh. I like the healing. I like the healing. It's like a regeneration. Overdrive. I think that's one we'll take. What does it do? It's finding the mixed primary weapon. As the first action no longer ends the turn. Yes. Absorption field. Any hit that does more than 33% of the mech's maximum health is re is reduced to that number. Oh. Reactive targeting centers. Mech gets a free shot. Gets a free shot back at the first enemy who attacks the mech each turn, provided there's enough ammo to do so. Oh wow. Yes. That's nice. Okay. Loadout. 
The kinetic strike module is a powerful yet precise weapon. It can provide a decisive advantage in close quarters and remove the benefit of cover from our enemies. Minigun. Can you customize and get a helmet on there too? Let's see. So we're at four. Wanna go that route? Well, since you can see that targeting thing, I think that might be better. Okay. Whoa, whoa, what's that? I kind of like that grayish color. That, that kind of works. It, in a way, it almost reminds me of the towel from Warhammer 40k. Mm-hmm. Okay. Very nice. Now research. I have difficulty understanding how such an advanced species could show so little empathy for the lives of other sentient beings. It goes against everything we have ever imagined. The technology is there, but with it comes a callousness we would never have expected. What could have brought them to this? Who knows? Okay, so we got these. Interrogate sectoid, which is instant. So why don't we take care of this? Beam weapons, research, research credit earned. Oh, that's good. That, that'll that help us because we got a few beam weapons to do. Our interrogation of the small alien captive was a learning experience for all parties involved. Although traditionally an interrogation would imply a discussion of sorts, perhaps under coercion, that possibility was out of the question given these unique circumstances. We were instead forced to undertake a more aggressive approach, namely through a series of invasive cranial probes inserted into the subject's prefrontal cortex. By interpreting the captive's responses to various stimuli, we were able to discern a great deal of information, more so than I had originally anticipated. Although it seemed to have, a, seemed to have little understanding of the various modifications it had been subject to at some point in the past, we did garner some information related to the aliens' miniaturized implants and power cells used in their weaponry. We've already begun analyzing this data for a possible incorporation, sorry, for a possible incorporation into future advanced weapon projects, weapon prototypes, including several power intensive beam weapons. Lasers. Let's see. See now, heavy lasers that. Mm hmm. So we'll finish up. What do you mean, no active research? Oops. Uh, we were doing the alien nav. That should be two days. There we go. Power generator. Power generator complete. Okay. Boundary? Is this where I'm going to find the research? Oh, yes. Our cyber suits and shaped units and shaped armor. Mm-hmm.
Uh, okay, hang on. Improved medkit, yes. Uh, improved pistol. Yes. And that's it. Okay. The foundry is already warmed up. I'll make sure to notify you as soon as production is finished. It's not much more we can do. We'll get a research. There we go. Assign new research. Satellite Nexus available for construction. Stealth satellites project available in the foundry. We've had the opportunity to study these devices in a limited fashion. As we discovered, they do contain some form of encrypted alien data. However, they're also com completely reliant on an internal power supply, which when depleted, renders the device inaccessible. The only means we found to gather information from this equipment is by routing its internal power systems through a crude assembly interface that bypass any built-in shutdown sequences. However, the alien data itself presented an even greater obstacle, as we're dealing with a programming language that is unlike anything found in our own systems. Fortunately, uh, the research team is quite capable, and we quickly assembled a small group of our best analysis for the task. We've already begun to establish patterns in the alien encryption algorithm, revealing small bits of information that can be integrated into our research. That's a big one. By studying the communication signatures of UFO and nav computers, we're sorry. We've recovered. There's a slight echo there. That's because I was holding my cup under my chin. So, yeah, sorry. Anyways, and if we've recovered um, nav computers. We've recovered. We could update our satellite network to mimic the alien communications. This would make the satellites much harder to detect if the aliens were going looking for them. Use the new project option in the foundry. Okay, um, five days, five days, six days, 18 days, 10 days, instant. This captive is clearly a rare and dangerous specimen. Specimen, We've already seen evidence of its unique mental abilities in the field. We should tread carefully, but we certainly cannot pass up the insights this might be able to prove during interrogation. I want to check something before I select. Okay, so how much is a satellite nexus? 250. But that's really what we're after. Back. Okay, that's the one that we want. So if we build a nexus here, scrap that one. And then build a nexus there, and then we've got like covered kind of thing. Okay. Uh which how much do we have for the gray market? Want some alien food? Okay. So how much do we have? Uh, no, no, Illyrium. We want fragment. Alien entertainment. Okay. Alien food. That was weird. I don't know what caused that. Which, okay, that can be sold. Alien stasis tanks. No research benefit. The latest contact turned out to be a dud. Probably just another drunk pilot who fell asleep on a long haul. Flight computers. Okay, alien surgery. That gets us 352. We can start building a nexus, which is something we really, really, really want. 
complete transaction. Things are heating up out there. We're tracking multiple unidentified targets. Build facilities, please, and we want a satellite nexus. Begin construction. That's going to take you guys some time. Um, boundary. Is there anything that we really need to take? Well, how much is stealth satellites? Hmm. Research. What do we have? We don't... Everything but the brain! I'll wait until I get the brain and then we'll do a very expensive modification. Okay, now, uh, research. Start new research project. Let's do the power source. That's only five days. Three satellites are coming our way. I got a Nexus coming up. Yeah, we're we're doing okay for our planning of the base. Go to the Situation Room. What do we have? Excel present. Cost fifty. Okay, uh, not enough intel to accuse the country of harboring the Exalt base. Alice? Alice. Alice. You get the only one we have. The only one. Let's do it. Covert operative deployed to disrupt. We've been at it for days now. All I can think about is my bunk. Yeah, uh, I understand that feeling. I do understand that feeling. Aliens terrorizing Alexander. Very difficult. Return to active duty. Fernanda Gracie has returned to active duty. This is a terror mission. This has to be a terror mission because we didn't pick. Oh god, yeah. Okay, hang on. Um Omega, let's, let's check weapons. Yes. Alice misses out on this one. We have a sniper there. Sidearms, everybody's sidearm okay? You have a grenade. Hang on. Load it. Which? Laser pistol, please. There we go. Um, edit unit. Uh, load out. Laser pistol. I thought so. Okay. <sighs> Loadout. This is going to be fun. This is going to be fun. Look at HP. 9 plus 8. Defense. Plus 10. Well. Plus 10. Aim 90. Oh my god. Okay. Touching down. Uh, begin assault. We're dropping you just inside the Egyptian border. The aliens are continuing their incursions into highly populated areas. We can't allow further civilian casualties to spread panic in the region.
Okay, approach civilians to enable evacuations, minimize civilian casualties, neutralize all hostile targets. Alien terror attack in progress. Strong civilian presence, take care to avoid civilian casualties. Failure will have severe political consequences for XCOM. Sky. Squad is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your fire out there. We have civilians on the ground. Repeat, civilians are in the AO. Enemy in sight. Okay, what are we gonna do with these guys? Well, just one of them. Uh, open fire. Okay, hollow targeting is on them. Shot wide. Seventy-five. Got it. Bye bye. Oh shit. That civilian's dead. Nothing I could do, apparently. Damn it. Now, what, what was that about casualties? Hang on. Maybe I can... How about this? Location confirmed. Move out. Okay, we're going to take the hit and save the civilian. Did that because of the, he has the healing damage thing. Hostiles are pulling back. Bye. I hear a cyber disc. I may have been able to move him there, actually, thinking of it now. Too late. Take the shot. Uh, that is not good. <clears> hmm. <throat> Got a tickle in my throat. Sorry about that. Heading to that location. Moving. <laughs> Look at that barrel heat up. Okay, Overwatch. I do hear a cyber disc, so we got to be I'm careful. On it, Commander. I am ready to go. Uh, terror missions. Always hated terror missions. Oh, old game in this one. That's why. There we go. Don't jump. I've got a visual. <laughs> Damn it. 
Swear all you want on the mist with those guys, please. Ooh. Cookie. Thank you. So I want to do this because it's absolutely absurd. We're going to punch it. No, 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 it's five. Approaching to engage. <laughs> oh, that felt good. That felt good. Oops. There we go. And heading to that location. There we go. Adjusting aim. And then some. That's two misses. That's rare for you. Damn it. No way that just happened. Damn it. Where'd he go? So, okay, let's see. Going up. Moving out. Eyes on target. Activate the cyber desk. Okay. Couldn't kill it. I can't get up there to do a kill. Zhang, can you? Possibly. Try. Right. Oh, jeez, that civilian's so lucky. Heading there now. You're safe now. Go, go, go. We saw a cyber desk, which we should be actually okay here. So we're gonna overwatch you. Slightly better angle. Overwatch you. Stomach is growling. We're in the middle of combat, tummy. No growling. I want you here. Aye, aye, Commander. And I want you aye, here aye, with your pistol. There we go. Good start. Oh. Oh, thank you. X-rays coming in from the side. 
A little bit surprised. How are you going to hold up? Oh. I wasn't expecting that, honestly. You're going to repair. In the zone. Neutralized. Okay, that's really what we wanted. Okay. Get to safety. All right. Um. Cookie? Hang on. Dash. Go to here, please, and time to use that. You are going to be in sick bay a long time, I think. Yeah, you think lasers wouldn't have an impact at all. Okay, four. Good Let's reload. On my way. Back to the pistol for you. He does a lot of damage with the pistol. I really want to give him a plasma pistol. That would be nice. Okay, go Zang, you now. go here, but I'm also going to get you to reload, okay? Reloading. There we go. Actually, I should take the time to uh, okay. save. This person. You're safe. Now get out of here. I can't tell where the hell the cover is there. Moving. Go there. Okay. I am ready to go. He moved, so yeah, we'll do that. Couldn't remember there if I'd moved him or not. Okay, you are healed up. And Cookie, where's a good spot for you? It's actually right there. Overwatch advanced fire control. Behind us. Affirmative. 
you're safe. Now get moving. 10-4. There's no cover bonus for him. Moving out. Okay. Can you just drop? Are you... How about we just move you to here and see if we can see something? We cannot. Was a bug though. Okay. Aye, aye, Commander. That was a good kill. That one there. That was good. Okay. And Overwatch, please. Overwatch. On my way. Check around the corner. Not seeing anything. Okay, here we go. You hear that? The end of the mission. Aye, aye, Commander. Anything over here? Doesn't look like it. Dash, I want you. To... Let's do this. Huh, huh. Over here now. Flimsy protection, but it will do. I want you to stay here like this. Headed there now. Okay, you don't see anything. This is good. Can we go inside, please? Thank you. Oh, 
Well, that's right. There's something I need to do. That's right. Back at the base. There they are. Where'd the human go? Okay, hang on. Let's see. We might be able to do this. How about this? That works only if... Get box out of here. Got a shot. I'll take the shot. No longer a threat. The rockets were total backup. It would kill them, but. Take the double shot. Oh, got it in one. Operational objectives completed. Twelve out of eighteen. Uh, sorry, got a text here. Okay. There we go. Very nice. Our troops really came through on this one. I'm glad everyone made it back safely. Hey! Shotzi made it okay. The armor took all that damage. Wow. Big hits restore four more health. Allows two reaction shots during Overwatch instead of one. I think I'll go for that. Smoke, smoke grenades now contain powerful stimulants. 20 to will and 10 to critical chance. Or more deaths. Uh, we'll get to that because I usually don't take it. That was a good one. XCOM squad deployed to Egypt has successfully stopped the terror attack in Alexandria. Panic decrease across Africa. We will be in touch, Commander. Yes, satellite over there. And that'll give us another one. We still got to do our home country, really. UFO power source in two days. Well, um, and we'll have to call it there. Um, I do hope you enjoyed this episode. And I hope you'll join me again for another installment. But until then, please do be safe, everyone. Bye.